Well, some fishermen in Tulsa are trying a different technique. New at 6, 2 News multimedia journalist Lee Carter found not everyone likes the idea. Got it. Jacob Tyler and his friend Cody Metcalf are fishing the Arkansas River, not with poles, but bows and arrows. If you're deer hunting, you only get one shot. You could shoot easily over a couple hundred times in one day doing this. They're sharing this stretch of river with cyclists, joggers, and sightseers like Carolyn Jones, who brought her grandkids to the pedestrian bridge today. That could be a concern, you know, you have little children. That could be dangerous. Carolyn is not the first to raise this concern. With bow fishing activity on the rise, the River Parks Authority received numerous complaints. Actually, the city ordinance, Title 26, prohibits bow fishing. It should have limitations, you know, where you can do it at. On the fishing piers, that's what they're made for. They should at least let us do it down here. But bow hunting is not allowed on the pier or the pedestrian bridge. It's banned in all Tulsa River and city parks. Now, there is one area where bow fishing is permitted, but the sign to let people know that is, well, a little hard to see. The River Parks Authority is working to change that. We're going to get some signage up next week. I mean, quite frankly, we need a better job of educating people about that because most people don't know. The place to bowfish is on the west bank, just south of the pedestrian bridge, and extends to the PSO fence line. That means for now, Jacob and Cody will have to sheath their arrows and move their fishing game. I understand it. In Tulsa, Lee Carter, 2 News works for you. The Tulsa River Parks Authority reaffirmed the designated area for bow fishing yesterday. They're now waiting on the city council to do the same in the ordinance. Well, just a